good evening and it is the launch of the brand new one day special one hour early john lockwood what are we in for fun, fun and frolics right? i've got my alex back Yay. Oh, i love working with you john i and do you I must have had you. a ball with this one day special now you ha you you must have done i did yeah. i really did i i gotta be honest I, I said to you earlier yeah i i we i was involved in all of these yeah. we sort of saw, first saw them in january and mm -hmm. everything and then when they came through i'm thinking what am i gonna do what am i gonna do so i picked up the flamingo one and i went crazy okay i absolutely have loved playing with these they're just so fun wait till you see these samples now i need to tell you something you have got a choice of the one day special but you can get the entire collection at a phenomenal price so let's have a look at the one day special first but hold off because i think you, when you see especially on flexi buy and if you're a freedom member the complete collection is amazing so we'll start off with this one uh, this one's my favorite out of the two because you've got the unicorn dreams the mermaid shore and the flamingo the flamingo forest i love the flamingo the the idea and this to me is a new concept yeah um what you've got is, we're used to getting dyes, we used to buying embossing folders, we used Indeed. to tying them together yeah. and having generic ones and using them. What Prescott have done with this mm. is they've selected and designed an embossing folder with matching dyes all to guide together in one story. Yes. So that what you've got is, as you said, with the Unicorn Dreams, you get this beautiful embossing folder. And I'm going to slide in yeah, a sample just to show better. So you've got this sort of perfect unicorn background. Mm. You've got the clouds and the stars and the hearts and the sort of rainbows between them. But then you're also getting the unicorn die, mm -hmm. the rainbow die, and a little sentiment die that says magic on it. Yay, magic. All in the one set. Wow, it's incredible. Together. But then you've got the mermaid shore. Yeah. And in this one, and I'll bring another one in that you can see the folder. I'll actually go for that one. I love yeah. that one. So again, you've got a sea based embossing folder. Love this. And then you've got the mermaid, you've got the shell, and you've got the most gorgeous seahorse. Oh, look at these seahorses. So you've got the seahorse, so you've got everything you need together yep. in one packet. And then we come on to the flamingo. I knew, I must have known that yes. we were going to do this today with what I'm wearing. So you've got the flamingo, and again, you've got that fantastic forest background. So you've got a beautiful sort of forest, but an art deco feel to nice. the background on that. You can really see, I don't know, I've used this for different things because it works so well. Yeah. But you get the flamingo, you get the pineapple, which mm. I just think is so cute, and you get the cheese plant leaf. Right. And you get all three, all of it. Yeah. And that's what I thought was so clever. I love this. So this one is what we're calling the fantasy bundle, and it's thirty-three pounds and ninety-seven pence. Then under the same item number nine eight three zero nine six, we've got the nature, the bees. The bees. Yeah. Yeah, and this is the bees knees again. Yeah. Not something that I would normally do. Yeah, yeah. Um, and I really didn't. And this is the first card I made with it. So with the bees, you get the embossing folder that gives you the honeycomb and the flowers. Yeah. You get the little sort of honey pot or honeycomb that they live in. Mm. You get the large bee and the small bee all together in one set. Right. And of course, as you said, the embossing yeah. folder. And the embossing folder all matches. Marvellous. Uh, so that's actually using the embossing folder. Oh, at the back. The backdrop. Yeah. If I go yeah, there, yeah. you can see that better. That's actually using the embossing folder. Yes, nice. Just on scratch art, right. sanded down. Lovely. Then you've got the birds and cages. Mm -hmm. So you get a beautiful classic embossing folder, which has got three birds in yeah. cages with it. You've got all the leaves, and they look as if they're properly hanging. They're not they just do. floating there. Yeah. But then you've got the beautiful birds as well, mm. which just match it, and everything's sized right. Yeah, yeah. You're not having to think, oh, will that work? Is that the right size? No, everything's sized perfectly. Because, yeah, I don't want to think about that. I just want to create. You just want to make, don't we? Yeah. And then finally, you get the butterfly dreams. And so here, you've got a beautiful frame, and it's using, this is the clever one. Mm -hmm. The two butterflies you see on that embossing folder there. Yeah are the same butterfly design that's used for the dies. Ah, really good. So you've good. got the corner one and you've got the main one on the top. So then you can decoupage. And a third butterfly in there. Wow. So you, each set has got at least three dies in it and the embossing folder all in one set. Fabulous. So that's you want two options of the one day special, details on screen. However, I want you to see now the deal that you're getting if you go for the complete collection, because this is silly. It is. This is silly. <laughs> it right. Is. So, it's £59.94. However, it, which is already, you've got a great saving on there. If you're a Freedom member, it's £53.95. Now, we've got FlexiBuy. So, two payments today of £26.98 to get 
all of these six embossing folders and 25 dies 26 pounds and 98 pence today and of course you don't have to wait to receive this until next month no yeah and where else can you go i've been saying this can you go into a shop and go can i just pay for this at half of it and just take it with me thanks yeah. thanks I, i've never thought of it that way actually yeah. it's like can i pay for half the takeaway and the other yeah. half when i've eaten it that's right and, yes yeah, basically if i liked it sort of thing no it's not <laughs> I like, like that, that analogy yeah <laughs> the well, takeaway you see where i think is with my stomach <laughs> or with my craft thing but I mean, I, I don't normally, we don't normally mm. think, sort of comment on the value and I'm yeah. terrible for doing this. I always end up doing it. Yeah. But it's each, it makes each individual folder and three dies less than £10, which That's I thought right. was crazy. Yeah. You know, we did make, you know, I, I put it together so I can't sort of stand and go, oh, I'm surprised we got away with that. No, we worked really hard to get that price. Indeed. To get it the right price. And again, as you said, with freedom, it's crazy. Eight ninety nine each, something like that. I don't know. Uh, you do the maths. <laughs> right. So let's show a few more samples, though, because these are just beautiful, and they're for any any t you know any occasion, aren't they? They are. I mean, it, it's a great thing that my friend of mine, Maxine, messaged me earlier because she'd seen a couple of samples and she said these are brilliant to be using with the children or the grandchildren yes. over the summer holidays. We've got, if you're like me, you've got six weeks holidays that start, we, we were checking earlier, start tomorrow. They do. You've got a lot of time to fill. But the, again, kids can use these. So you've got like the birds in cages. Mm. They just work so well. This is simply oh, cut <laughs> in colour cord card yep. and then sanded. That's it. Stunning. Really it's simple. So All things like this. Really modern. You could do this, and again, to me, I've got cards in here. I've got projects in here for kids. Yeah, as well. I've got projects in here for guys. Mm -hmm. This one, you love this, this is one. my favourite. I love this one. This screams to me, if you're old enough like me to remember, this is Miami Vice. Yeah. You know, I can see Crockett and Tubbs just walking <laughs> across the background there. It's almost like the titles. Yeah. But you've got that idea. You've got things like the mermaid. Mm -hmm. You've got that, but you've got the sea as well behind her. You've got the shells. You've got the seahorse. I and love this was this your sample. favourite, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, I love this sample. Very simple. Love it. But you can see what I mean about how mm. the folders are the right sizing for the dies. Yeah. You're not using the wrong size of design at the back. So it's that very it's hard out to of explain. kilter. Yeah, yeah. yeah, exactly. It's not. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see another unicorn one as well. So we've got, I love that one. Yeah. Um, and I mean, I, Sam and I were talking earlier because, as you know, he's not been well, so I've brought I him know. with me today, bless him, just to make sure. And <laughs> we were saying earlier, we were looking a couple of days ago, and we saw a, a unicorn die that cost a fortune. Yeah. 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 But you're getting the folder with it. But I just love that. Or. Oh, go on. Which one? Your shaker. Oh, yes, yes, yes. You know, I'm obsessed with these. Shaker card. Love it. That's so pretty. And if you think that's the embossing folder just done twice, I've not even matched the pattern. Oh. But it's really hard. You have to look really carefully to see that it doesn't match. Yeah, but There's I have noticed. No, that's great. That's a, I hadn't noticed at no. all. It's fabulous. All right, so this is what's called, thank you, John, thank a you. why not deal. Why not? Here it is. This will sort of explain it all. So, right, Crafts 2 Press. You've got the embossing folder and the die sets, the complete collection. The combined price is £67.94. Your special price is £59.94. If you've got a freedom discount of 10%, that takes it down to £53.95. So your freedom saving, including postage, £5.99 plus £2.95 equals £8.94. It's a why not deal. There you go. 398429 is your item number. Now, I'm very excited for this I'm as well. I'm very excited for these. We've been waiting for yeah. these to be ready. This is the brand new eyes ink embossing ink. Right. And I know we've got embossing inks. Mm -hmm. You know, I've had them before. What I, I love about these, mm -hmm. I think we know the quality. Yeah. We've been doing it on here for over two years now. Mm -hmm. People know the quality and know the value of them. Now, what we've put in here is, this is the three brand new products. So you've right. got the large <laughs> size Thank embossing you. pad. So you've got your, your big standard size embossing pad. Yeah. And it's been done in the same way mm -hmm. as I think make their pads. So the slight difference is this is actually foam. Right. So what oh, happens is the embossing this. ink, if you feel like how sticky that is. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Right, that's been put in under vacuum. Okay. So what it means is it's, it's got a lot of the ink in there. Right. Yeah? But it also means that it's very, very hard to mucky it. I've had embossing ink pads in the past. You've seen them where they've I gone remember. black and grey and, and they've got covered bits in glitter covered and... in glitter. Yeah. yeah. Because this is foam, I can scrape it off. Oh, that's good. Without damaging the pad. And if I put a colour ink on top, it won't soak in. Yeah. It will go. But you get that, which is brilliant. Mm, yeah, but then you get size. the mini, mini one. one, 
which is exactly the same, just the smaller size, the same as your small size inks. Mm -hmm. So you've got exactly the same, put in under the vacuum. Um, it's super sticky ink, right. which is exactly what we need. Yes, definitely. Yeah. Mini one, so you've got one for home, yeah. one for your craft kit. Yeah. But this to me is the marvel. I'm going to lean down for this. Ooh. This mm -hmm. is your embossing pen. Right. Now I've had embossing pens before. Again, I'm, I can't stand here and pretend we've reinvented the no, wheel. No, yeah. But they've been, first of all, very expensive, and normally you get them with a very, very fine tip. And the fine tip is designed so that if you're stamping a sentiment and something misses, mm. that you can draw it back in. Indeed. Which is great. And you can colour with it. But if you colour with it, what you end up doing yeah. is you end up ruining the fine tip. So what they've done, I think, is Stop give you a I'm chisel tip about. on the other side. <laughs> I think we'll just, just give it. up on that. Oh, yeah, let's just leave that. But they've given you a chisel <laughs> tip on the other side. So if you want to colour big areas... You That's can do. So good. The other thing is, yes. if you notice that that looks slightly bluey. Yeah. And this is slightly greeny. Yeah. That's so that when you stamp them down, when it dries or goes off, yeah. it's clear. Right. But when you stamp it onto white, you get a slight green hint to it. Okay. So you can see where you've gone and if it's matched, worked or not. Yeah. And then if it hasn't, you can go in with I that. Can. If it hasn't, you can go in with your pen without having to heat emboss it, then go in with your pen, then heat emboss again. Yeah. No That's worries. Fabulous. I just love this. I really do. I was desperate to bring it. Okay, this is <laughs> flying out the door. 10% of the stock has gone. Yeah, I'm going to leave that. 10% of the stock has gone. 11 99 I need to get my mitts on this. 109-936 is your item number. All you need to do is give us a call 017-330-2000 or check out on the website at hachanda.com. We're going to shimmy on over to the demo area, but first we're going to show you some inspiration. <music> Jazz hands to you. <laughs> Thank you. Yay. <laughs> right, so I'm just going to trim a piece of card to size to okay. start with. So all I'm going to do is, sometimes it's easier. I always say this when you've got a new embossing folder. Mm -hmm. Measure it. Okay. But don't just measure the outside. It's almost worth cutting a piece of, cutting a random piece of card and embossing it to see what size the emboss is in case you want a piece of exact size. Yeah. So what I found when I was doing this, the best size for me was four and a quarter inches. Mm -hmm. Oops, I've lost my blade. Oh. I've dropped it somewhere. Uh oh. Oh right. dear. Do we need? Yes, we might have to pull in the spare of that. Then, However, do you have a uh, a uh, cutting a trimmer? I will take a piece that I've already got cut from yeah, another pack. Trimmer. Sorry guys, it starts all already. Right. I'm an hour early and I'm already messing up. <laughs> we are. Yeah, but you didn't expect to be on an hour early. No, to be that's fair. That's true. Yeah, we were actually sat in the cafe in the supermarket nearby. Did you get a phone, phone call? call? Yes. John. We just had a nice leisurely drive down. Um, so what I've done is I've cut this already to four and an eighth okay. by to nearly six, so sort of five and seven eighths. Okay. But what you can do is the easiest way to do it is class the folder as a four by six. Right. Yep. So just cut yourself a four, four by, by six. six piece of card and it makes it a lot, lot easier. Okay. So what I thought we'd do is I was going to use the embossing ink. Yeah. Because what I got the opportunity to do, I think, in these shows is go through a lot of techniques we can do with embossing folders. Yes, please. And things that perhaps we've forgotten we can do or things that, you know, we've not seen before. And we get to see the new ink. And you get to see the inks, because you can see already, is what I was talking about, you see on the overhead, how lovely and clean mine isn't. This is shocking. Yeah. Where, where's John and what have you done with him? But it must, <laughs> But no, that's actually, if you compare that to the new one... Yeah. That's, that's really good. It's actually quite dirty, because <laughs> it doesn't soak in. I so see. I've been able to just clean that off. Yeah. I've already got glitter on it, and all I can have to do is just take a scrap of card... Yeah. ..and literally just... Take it off. Take it all off. Mm-hmm. 
And that's the, uh, that's the, the, the horrible bit. Yeah. So, which, what, which folder are we going for? Which set are we going for first? I'll let you choose. Just definitely fantasy. Right, definitely fantasy. So, in fantasy, you have the... Flamingo. Flamingo, the unicorn, or the mermaid. Unicorn. Unicorn. Okay. Cool. Right, so, what I've got here is... So, I'm going to open my folder. In fact, I'll take the whole piece out. Yeah. There we go. I like these so, folders. Mm. This is so useful. Mm. I think we have got it. I think it's on the website. Okay. So what you've got with your embossing folders is you've got a bumpy and outy side and an inny side. Yes. So if you think about it, normal is an inny, like a belly button. Okay. That's the way I think about it. So for this, we want to ink on the inny side. Right. Which is your flat piece that goes in. Okay. So if you're wondering which to do on this, always think belly button. Okay. It's the way I do it. I love your analogies. I have to have an analogy, okay. otherwise I'm completely lost. I forget <laughs> everything. If I don't have a silly story, it's gone. <laughs> you, I, I must tell you my bow tying one eventually one day. All right. So, but what you do is, just going to take my pad okay. and I'm literally, you see how sticky it is? L yeah, I'm look not, at that. It's like I'm pulling not sort it up. of, you know, it really is nice and sticky. Nice and sticky. And, and this isn't a new one I've been given for the show. Yeah. This is the one I tested originally when they sent them through to me. Right, 20% gone of the inks. And so what I've done is coated one side like I was inking a stamp. Yeah. Take my piece of card and because I'm going to heat emboss, mm. yeah, I'm going to just use an anti-static bag. Right. With an anti-static bag, I try and say this every time. Mm -hmm. Seen people do it, I used to do it, and I used to take the bag and wipe it over, la la la, done. Right. Do you need to tap it? That doesn't it? do anything, it's not magic fabric. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, it isn't magic fabric, it's the powder that's in there. Get some out yeah. and move the powder about, that's what takes the static off. It's not, you know, magic. <laughs> and all we do then, I'm gonna put the piece of card Onto the outy side. The bit that's not inked. The bit that's not inked. Okay. And close my folder over it. Right. And that may, then I don't want to be touching it again. Okay. Okay. So then all I'm going to do is run it through my machine on the emboss plates or the emboss setting yep. and run it through. Okay. So while that goes through, what I'm going to do next, take a piece of card and I'm going to use now, let's go with, let's Watch your go. Fancy. Oh, are these new? These are. This is this. This is. I think this is the new um, Ising. I think we've had it once before. Right. It's sold out. Right. Because usually when we bring Ising on, it absolutely yeah. flies. Um, we we have. Um, yeah, we've had a bit of a problem with a with a pallet going missing as well this week. So oh, <laughs> we've had right. lots of fun. But these are all in. Okay. But what we're going to do? Take that out. Well, look at and the you emboss. You can see, hopefully, really nice oh, crisp. Yeah deep emboss. Gorgeous. And you are getting all three of these fantastic powders at 11 299 They're big pots, aren't they? They are. They're bigger than normal pots. Yeah. You normally actually get, I believe, it's like a 25 mil. Yeah. I think these, I can't remember the size of these. Um, are these, 25 so these are 25, mils, so yeah. I think you normally get a 15 or a 20 mil. Yeah. I know when I tested them at home, they're a lot bigger than the normal Definitely. ones I've got. And again, these aren't new ones for the show, these are mine from home, yeah. so they've been used quite a lot. But what they've done is, when they do this, I zinc, a lot of glitter embossing powders yeah. are coloured embossing powder uh -huh. with glitter added. Yes. When they make this, they grind the glitter into the powder at the same time. Oh, so it should stay even more glittery. So you don't get any voids. Okay, that's great. So all I'm going to do is put that one away. Sure. And then give it a flick because you'll have glitter left. Yeah. But the great thing is, this is one of the things I always say is a good test of a good embossing powder as well. Mm -hmm. Because I should heat set that and then re-ink and yeah. everything. I don't want them to mix. They won't mix. Okay, this is interesting. Because, the, because it holds so high. Yeah. When I put the green on, if we look, can you see there's no red? That's fabulous. Actually, I have got a little bit. Not to much. To one side. That's because I didn't flick it off well enough. No, but, don't but I'm worry. not getting piles of it coming out, and that will get lost in there. Yeah. And then I'm going to go in with the blue on the end. These are stunning, striking colours. And what I like is they don't change. When you heat them. When you heat them. Right, OK. Look at that. It's so bold. Oh, John, I'm going to be broke. 
<laughs> yeah, I know you've already said about I um, uh, two of the bits on the show, and now yeah. you want something else. Yeah. That's what I love when you weren't here. Yeah. Uh, you were still posting on Facebook. Oh, you made yeah. some things. You were still crafting. Yeah. I, I didn't get much time, that. but yes, I. Yeah, I'm definitely going to now. Honestly, since I've been back here, I've already I've been purchasing back again. But I hear Catherine's just as bad. Oh, we're all as bad. Yeah. Um, I went. I did a workshop in a craft shop yesterday. Yeah. Um, I didn't need anything. Right. I still managed to spend thirty pounds. Yeah, I know. Can't help it. So, just going to reheat. Okay. Um, over twenty percent of the embossing powders have now gone. Very busy. Yeah. My see. the magic. I love the magic. There we go. Right, so make sure your heat gun's hot. Yeah. I'm lucky I've got the wild one. It's oh, really hot. I always like what you, you how you compare it to an iron. Iron. Yeah. yeah. But you know, like normal embossing powder, what you see is that it actually clips. Um, it melts and you see it. Yeah. What you actually see on this is it winking at you. Yeah. Can you see it winking? Yes, you That's can. That's yeah. it turning. So don't overheat it. Okay. Thinking it's not going. As it winks at you, that is it setting. Because the powder itself is the glitter. Got you. It's not just glitter added in. I just go through. I love watching this. I could sit and watch this for hours. To I be know. Honest. Uh, so yeah, you are getting these wonderful three colours. There are other options as well. Um, have a look on the web. Eleven ninety-nine. What? Volubi volubilis. Volubilis. Oh, right. right now. What is that? I asked them when I went over to France and they said it's a flower. Oh. And they couldn't explain which flower it was. Yeah. Then after the last show, yeah. a couple of ladies posted on my Facebook who speak French and said it's morning glory. Is it? So in England we know the flower as morning glory. Right. But in France it's known as volubilis. Right. Which is the blue colour. In the right. same way as we'd have cornflower. Okay, yeah. But then if you can see, I've got... This is then the perfect. super sparkly. There we go. Look at this, it's dazzling, amazing. But nice, that's nice, coming nice. from the powder, but look how crisp the white is. Yes. That's because we had a good embossing powder and a good embossing folder. Yeah. Crazy as it sounds, they're not all the same. No, I know. I and know. I know that we always like to sort of, you know, everyone thinks not everything is made the same, to be oh. fair. I'm going to pop that onto one side, because what okay. I'm going to do now is we're going to need to add something to that. Right. And this is the great thing, we've got the background, mm -hmm. but we'd be stuck what to do. Yeah. So we've got the dyes that match. And that's Perfect. what I absolutely love. So you get the unicorn. Look at his Cute. eyelashes. If I hold him up, you might see. There you go. Mascara. Can you see his beautiful eyelashes on there? Just so cute. The rainbow mm. cuts, and it cuts each one of these out. Oh, But doesn't right. separate them. OK. So if you cut that, and it cuts all of them out, you just get a load of bits. Yeah. It separates them so you can cut them out, so you can do like this. Mm, I see. That's, that's really nice. Because that makes me want to sing Paint Your Whole World with a Rainbow. I know. You? Yeah, and then you get the little magic as well. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to grab a piece, just a piece of white card, mm -hmm. grab my inbound plates, which would make sense, Ooh. wouldn't it, John? Yeah. Get things in the right place. <laughs> I'm just going to cut the unicorn, cut the cloud, and cut the magic. And this is uh, the fantasy collection, if you're going for the one-day special. But obviously, if you're going for the complete collection, you will get everything for a very good price. So, just going to run those through. So, while that's running through, we'll just put it onto, we'll put that onto one side. So, what okay. I'm going to do this time yeah. is just going to do a little bit of sort of almost faux embossing. Okay. So, I've got my embossing pad. Mm -hmm. Should have pre cut these before, but oh, you know no. me, I like to do it as I'm going no, along. It's nice to see how they cut anyway. So, I think it's nice sometimes to see that people. Not to have everything prepped. Yeah. I've got so many. I mean, you look back, there's a lot. Oh, my goodness. Yes. You can tell how much I enjoyed it by how much I've got, how yes. many sample preps and things I've got. So you can see, without actually even embossing it, Wow. I've got all of the embossed detail on yeah, that Yeah, that's dye. really deep embossing. So yeah. you're getting the stars. So I've got that. I've got the magic. And you get you the have, little John. star. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted to start singing them from one of the films. <laughs> From, from Pitch Perfect, it's one of my favourites. So there we go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. You even get the little star out. Oh, yeah. To go above the eye if you want to. Yeah. But it matches perfectly. But this is, I struggle for kids' cards. Mm -hmm. I really do. It's not something I know what to do or how to do no, for. I don't. It doesn't, it's not in my stash at all. Whereas this is really great. But then if and you see, too, but... what I meant here is they're oh. all. 
Separate like that, Separate that's great. Like but that. they don't fall off. But they don't fall off, which is exactly what we want. So on a rough piece of paper, mm -hmm. I'm just going to take this and I'm just going to... Dunk him in. Dunk him in. You can see in. again how sticky that Press is. Press him down. Yeah. Yeah. Everywhere. Mm -hmm. Okay. Go. Oh, missed you can his see, legs. You can see he's can gone green. Can you see yes, the colour? Yeah, I can. He's gone slightly green. green. Yeah. And that's coming from the ink. Yeah. The, I, I don't know how they've done it, but I don't know how Eyes Ink do half the things they do. Yeah, they're such um, a good company. They really are. Some of it is actually literally magic. Yeah. Because this is clear when it dries. Right. So you will still get all those watermark effects and everything you can do with a clear one, because it is clear. Good. But it's just got this greeny tinge to it till it dries. OK. It's just weird. <laughs> good weird. Good weird. Yeah. So all I'm going to do now, now, to do this, you do have to have an extra spare pot right. for your embossing powder. That's fair enough. But when I'm getting a big pot, I just don't, don't mind. mind as much. No. Because I'm not, all I'm going to do is lightly sprinkle over. Okay, are you doing a mix then? I'm going to do a mix. Lovely. So obviously I can't put this all back into one pot, but I have a jug at home and I should have brought it with me actually. And in that jug, I keep mm -hmm. all of the bits of I've got messed up and everything. That is fabulous. And I make my own sort of frontage thick one yeah. Yeah, to use for triple embossing and things like that. So a little bit of green and then bring in just to seal it. Yeah. Make sure it's covered everywhere. I'm going to use this one. What is it? Which is the transparent ooh. glitter. <laughs> Everybody in our heads went ooh at the yeah, same time. That. And this one is a clear glitter, so all clear. you get is a sparkle. Oh, So I can nice. put a little bit of this over the top. Okay. There we go. And it will just seal everything in it. Okay. So let me just get mine. Okay, just out. while uh, John's getting that, this is the bottom one here. So you've got the transparent, uh, the venice, or Venice? It's a transparent or... Venice, which means high clear, high shine gloss. Right, okay. Clear. You get the transparent palette, which means the glitter. Yeah. And I can't remember what the third one is. Well, it says. Oh, yeah, that really is. Opaline. Mother of Pearl. Oh. So that you get a pearl finish. Nice, okay. So that's thingy. But then you can see now I've got. Yeah. Here we go. This is good fun. And watch it wink. And watch it wink, and you will see it winking at you, and that's it setting. Yeah. But can you see you've almost got like an aurora borealis in it? Yes, it's That gorgeous. is the addition of the clear glitter. Yeah, I can see that. Because that has more of a sort of, like say, a, an aurora borealis look to mm. it. I'm just going to set our. I love watching it. I could sit and watch this for hours. I yeah. really, genuinely could. Don't let the magic blow away. <laughs> Super busy for the clear ones now you've just seen them. 1199 541916 is your item number. So Shall I open them? Yeah, you can do. Shall I just open them? So oh, uh, hopefully there's no lids on. While you're doing that, I'm just going to cut myself another rainbow. Okay, no worries. So this one is the Transparent Venice. Venice. So it's a high gloss. Okay. And then the next one uh, is, this is the <laughs> transparent palette, I think. <laughs> I, always get, I always play and just craft when I've got I you. I know. It's good. And we tend to do run off the set, yes. Yeah, we like that. We're quite good with that. We're good. And then this is the final one, which is the relief opaline. There we are. OK. Cool. So the right. opaline will give you a beautiful pearl finish, like a mother of pearl. Nice. We're 20% gone on those already. Mm -hmm. Sorry. That's all good. That's what so we want. all I'm doing is I've cut another one and it's really easy to cut out the clouds. Yeah. So I'm just going to cut out the clouds because always look at dyes and we, we say this very little. I mm. think sometimes we, we're always so eager to tell you about, oh, get this one, get this one. Yeah. We forget to say, do look at the dyes you've got and say, oh, what else can I do with it if I snip a bit out? Yeah. You know, I'm terrible for not doing that. I've got to be honest and thinking about it. But with this... Oh, that's nice. That's making it, it stand out now. It just meant... 
that it makes that sort of rainbow pop a little bit. Yeah. So nice. I've got the clouds at the bottom. So I've got here a card blank. This is just watercolour card right. folded in half, cut into a blank. Because I like a nice strong, this is the 300 that I always use. Yeah. A little bit of my craft artist. There we go. That looks good. It so looks so We could fun mat and layer, but really you don't have to. And if you think about it, if you have the heat gun, yeah. the kids can do this. Yeah. If you supervise them. Yeah, you yeah. could supervise them really well to do this. Let's grab a little bit of foam tape. OK. You look, you meant business with those scissors then. Mm. <laughs> I only ever work with big scissors. <laughs> so we'll just put that on. OK. I'm just going to put a little bit on the back of each of the clouds. Yeah. That will fit. We'll take that off. Mm -hmm. uh, so we've popped on screen the uh, complete bundle. I mean, £26.98, your first instalment. We'll ship it out to you and you can play. And almost 20% of the stock has gone of the complete collection. So we've got our unicorn. Cute. And then I'm just going to use spray glue because I like it, because this is too small. Yeah. To me, it's far too small. So and too fiddly. And yeah. then, yeah. Into the box. They've given me a bin. Have they? I think that's because you're here. They never give me a bin. No, it's not because of me. It is. Oh, yeah, I like that. But th there we go. I mean, I don't actually use it. Yeah, it's just there, but it's, it's nice. It's there for a fact. N nice thought to have it. Yeah, it, it's a good idea of them to put it on there for yeah. me. Just hold that in place, but, you know, bless him. Ben's hoping that I will. But then if I bring that one up... Cute. Okay, quite basic, but you can see what you can do. Yeah, and it's nice because you're showcasing the dyes and you're showcasing the uh, embossing powders. It is, and what I love is the fact that these are all together for you. Yeah. So it's pre-done. It's almost no thinking. It's sort of no-brainer crafting. Yeah, like and it. Just put them in, and slide it back in. Thank you, John. I'm going to leave you for a second to get set because we're halfway through our first hour. Uh, here's the website, so you can see not just the one-day special, but also you can see. Uh, oh yes, there's individuals if you want them, but obviously best value is if you go for the full set. But look, these are the embossing inks, new today. You've got the big one, the little one, and the double-ended pen. Now, we haven't shown you these either because we have got some spritzers, some sprays. There's a sunshine collection, a fantasy collection, and also uh, the seashore collection. Oh, loads of storage as well. Nice. Okay, so one day special, brand new today. I adore these. You've got the fantasy bundle or you've got the nature bundle or you can get absolutely everything. So here we go. This is the fantasy collection. What is brilliant is that you have got the dies and the embossing folder that creates a scene. It creates a story and they've been sized. So the imagery on the embossing folders are sized perfectly so that the dies, the size of the dies work in harmony. I just love that moment. I adore the seahorse. And then as you can see, we have got the unicorn who's very happy. Very, very happy and has the longest lashes I've seen. Um, and it's got the corresponding um, embossing folder. Thank you very much. The embossing folder, <laughs> which is this one here. It's actually to the side. I should swap them over. Yes, let me do this because, yeah, that goes with that one. And that goes with that with the uh, mermaid. Perfect. And then if you come down to the this one, you've got the embossing folder here. That's the fantastic forest with all the palm trees and then you go down to the dies that match that work brilliantly and I adore him as well absolutely love him right so let's show you some samples of course I'm going to go back to this one because it's a shaker card love it and it's got our um, unicorn in the back there you go and also this is such a nice card let's bring this in love it there's a whole Oh, I wonder what a, um, you know how they say like a, 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 a kaleidoscope of butterflies? Um, I wonder what, um, what is it? It's a blessing of unicorns. Oh, I never oh. knew that. You know, collectively, when you've got a group, blessing of unicorns. Oh, that's so nice. There you go, we've got a blessing of unicorns in this card. And then we've got this one. This is so nice. It's lovely cut on the mirror card, isn't it? Now, also, small samples very quickly. Let's show you these two. I haven't shown you these. There we go. Look, isn't that stunning with our mermaid? Look, and the embossing folder, it all ties in. 
and we love our seahorses. Love them. And last but not least, let's get flamingos, flamingos. This one. This is nice because decoupaged up a little bit. That looks really effective. And then here's another fantastic flamingo. Beautiful. £33.97 price. Uh, pack. £33.97 pence is the price, that's what I was trying to say. 983096. Now you can also go for the nature under the same item number. We have got our bees, so we've got the bee embossing folder and this goes with our bees underneath. Um, and with the dies, here it is, as you can see you've got two different size bees and also the little beehive. Then moving along you can see we've got um, these, sorry Emily, you can see we've got the birds, three birds, mum, dad and baby and at the top on the embossing fold you've got the bird cages, that's a really nice scene and then you have got the embossing folder of the um, butterflies, that's so pretty and of course you can use them separately, individually, they don't have to be used together all the time and then some samples very quickly, we've got the bees here, that looks so effective. All sorts of different occasions. And this one, that's so good, isn't it? Um, sorry, there, I had to put my hand down there. Um, this one with the birds, again, another shaker card, which is fabulous. And this sample is also absolutely glorious. And then last but not least, let's show you some butterflies. I don't think I've shown you this sample. Oh, this is lovely. That's using some more of the embossing powders. Isn't that glorious? And this is stunning as well. £33.97 for the one day special options. However, your biggest value is if, or biggest saving is if you go for the complete collection, especially if you're going to do flexi buy. You've already got an £8 saving on the one day, on the complete collection anyway. If you're a Freedom member, it's an extra 10% off, uh, £53.95. And then if you spread the cost, for just £26, I think it is, and 98 pence, you can get this entire collection sent out to you once you've paid that. There you go, 398429 is your item number. Now again, this is what we call a why not deal. Why not? Because you're saving on your postage as well. There we go, your freedom saving, including postage, is £8.94. So it's well worth becoming a freedom member. You might just might as well. Why not? That's what we mean. There we are. Um, okay, let, let me show you these inks. Oh, really? Right, a quarter of the stock of, has gone. Now, these are the new today sticky inks from Eyes Ink. And they're, as you can see, they are super sticky. Let me just get the lid off. <laughs> so sticky. They're, look at the stickiness. Wow, it's like a lovely sticky toffee. That's what it feels like. Um, but it's got so much ink in there. And then you've also got the mini one. So this is great. So this is for your craft room. This is to take to craft groups. And then this is also brilliant because it's your double-ended. So it's got the chisel. And also you can see that that's blue. This is green, which means you're going to see where you've actually stamped. That is so good. And here's the fine nib as well. I need this in my life. Okay, £11.99 for all of that. I mean, that's such a good price as well for those. And you know that these are going to last a long, long time. Oh, I cannot do this. Ben, sorry. Uh, 11 99 uh, Are we? Right, yes. 32 stamps. I love the design of these. I hadn't seen these before. I love the design of these. They're kind of that, like, medieval, oldie-worldie. They're great. Um, and they're all... And they're also on flexi buy as well. I mean, look at the size of them. These are for your like your big cards, your masterpieces. Could be home decor. Look at that. You could even make blocks. You know, for the kids, couldn't you? you could stamp onto wood, which is actually one of the samples that we've got here. Ah, Sam's room. There you go, Sam's room. Perfect. That looks so good. Look at all the detail in this stamp. They're all slightly different as well. How good is this? Of course. Stamping onto fabric, that looks so cool. Oh, look, oh no. The, okay, John, you ready? Mantelpiece pleaser. Yes, it is. Look at this, it's huge. Joy, I, I just think that's a brilliant composition. But these stamps are absolutely glorious. Just 34 pounds for that price. Oh, and it's on Flexi Buy. Two payments of 17 pounds and 50 pence. And you've got the ands. 
Look, underlined, I like the swirls underlined. Two payments of £17.50, 276937 is your item number. So this is a back by popular demand. This is also a back by popular demand because you've got the lattice flowers and the lattice leaves. And you will go to these again and again and again and again. Um, I don't think you could ever have too many flowers and flourishes in your craft stash. But have a look at the detail in them. They're absolutely stunning, aren't they? So you've got some with the lattice detail and then you've got the ones that will, if you just want to, you can just cut the whole flowers as well. But I mean, just check out these. There we go. Beautiful samples, aren't they? I love that lattice effect. It's very delicate and very, very ornate. Now for these dies, it is just 23 pounds and 98 pence. Item number is 130717. All you need to do is give us a call 01733602000 or check out on the website at hachanda.com. Now, if you don't yet know, perhaps you're new to us here at Hachanda and you don't yet know what FlexiBuy is, then we can tell you more. Flexi order has arrived at Hachanda. What is Flexi order? When you place an item on FlexiBuy in your basket, you qualify for Flexi order which means any other items you add to your basket will also be included in your FlexiBuy payments, so you can spread the cost over multiple monthly payments. After your first payment is made, your entire order will be dispatched. When you add at least £60 worth of any items to your shopping basket, either online or on the phone, you'll qualify for our Flexi Order offer. This means you can spread the cost of your order over equal monthly FlexiBuy payments, offering you the extra flexibility when you shop with us. Flexi Order, making your shopping experience with Achanda easier. Okay, John, next demo. Right, Let's keep next going. Demo. So, she says I'm what I'm going to do this time is because you said flamingo earlier and you like that, I thought I we'd do that. something quick with the flamingo. Yes, so, please. just going to cut a piece of card to five by seven. It's one of the things I love about a four by six embossing folder. Yeah. Is that it fits in our standard sizes. So, you've got four by six, five by seven, six by eight. Right. You can keep going up. You know what the sizes are going to be to mat and layer up. Got you. So, it just makes it even easier. So, I'm going to go to five by seven. And what I'm going to do, move that out of the way for the minute, I'm now going to spray this. Right. So I'm going to give it that sort of fantasy colour look. Oh, using these? Yes. Excellent. So I'll just explain about these. So we, I've brought before, I think we've had these on once before, I've brought you before the eye zinc sprays and the quick dyeing dye sprays. Right. And I think we're all used to sprays and we're all used to sort of the way that they work mm -hmm. and things. The two things that are different about these, and I always think it's important to explain, mm -hmm. the first is Aladine, who make eye zinc, have invested in new technology so that these don't clog. Oh, good, because there's nothing more frustrated. No, there isn't. There it's really isn't. Sorry. And I was talking to Leonie about it a few weeks ago. Yeah. And I actually said to her, I've got to the bottom of, a, of one of the greens, and she didn't believe me. <laughs> so now I've yeah. got to the bottom. I've thrown it away as empty. No, you haven't. Yeah, I have. Yeah. She's never, ever got to the bottom of a spray bottle uh, which is such a without shame. it clogging and blocking. Yeah. So they've done that. The second thing is these are not dye sprays. Okay. These are pigment. Right. So pigment means that it stays open for longer. Okay. It means that we can heat emboss with it. Yeah. But it also means that you get opaque colour rather than translucent. Right, okay. So we will get solid colour. Okay. But these are water based, mm -hmm. which means that we can mix them with water and we get different effects. Yeah. We can put them down, we can put water on and take some off. Right. Get that drop effect. But somehow, and this is the other thing I was saying about eye zinc, these are also suitable for fabric. And once you iron it, this won't wash out. So these are what I used on wow. those jeans. So mul I love things yeah. when they're multi-purpose. So this will work on yeah. everything. Right. Again, like eye zinc does. So you don't have to buy a, a, an opaque colour spray for card and one for plastic, yeah. and one for fabric and yeah. one for metal. These will actually go on to things like wood and concrete. Really good. Let's show this you these details just before you spritz. Hang on. This is the sunshine. There we are. You get those wonderful three colours. Chamomile, henna and... Santal. What is Santal is oh. the red. I'm not going to read the names because <laughs> I'm not going to get them. You just need to know that's the sunshine. Right. Yeah. Um, and then next up under a different item number, we've got all the blues. Um, this one's called Seashore. Gorgeous. £13.49, 291404. And then this one is your fantasy. Gorgeous, 
gorgeous colours. Again, 1349 713063. Right, take it okay, away, John. So I thought we'd just do a simple rainbow Why not? to start with. Or what I'm going to do is actually do the primaries. Okay. Which is my favourite one of doing. So I'm gonna pick up, I'm gonna use the Santal, which is the bright red. Okay. So this is your classic red, and all I'm going to do. There we go. Nice and bright. Okay, bright. I then go to yellow. Mm-hmm. You see what I mean about them being... This is on watercolour card. Right. So these are soaking in. So you're getting that beautiful opacity mm. and brightness of colour, but it's soaking in. Normally when you spray onto a watercolour card, it mm. goes in and it goes weak. Yeah. This it doesn't. Stays so I'm going to go strong. with the blue, but actually I'm going to use for a change. I always use the bright blue. I'm going to use the sky blue. Yeah. Nice. But you see how they're mixing in. I'm getting yep. green. Now, these are fabric. This is what they, they, we call them the fabric ones okay. because they will work on fabric, but they work perfectly fine on paper. They're designed to do everything. Right. So this shouldn't work in that I can mix the colours and reactivate them with water. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. Because they should be water-soluble. Oh, I love that effect. But it's doing it. It's doing it. Yeah. And the thing is, this top bit here... It's dry, isn't it? It's totally dry. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, shouldn't work. Don't oh know how it goodness. does. Oh, yeah. Do not understand it. We don't care as that long as we can work, play, really. But it works. Yeah. Exactly. Now, because I've put some water on that, because it's arched slightly, but mm -hmm. normally watercolour card would be curled up in a like that, ball yeah. like that. It's not, because somehow they're not that wet. But look, none through to the back. Yeah. Very good. Sits on the surface. Brilliant stuff. Yeah. I'm going to leave, I'm, I would leave that to dry five, ten minutes properly. Yeah. Because when you start to cut it or things, then it goes into the fibres and it can be a bit damp. Okay. So. In true Blue Peter in style. In true Blue Peter style. Are there other shows available? What I've done is, here's one I made earlier. Yeah. And what I did was, I took the embossing folder. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And I put it on and I used my knife around it and cut oh. round. That's it. Nothing neat, nothing too precise. Okay. Popped that into my paper trimmer and just trimmed it down. Right. And matted the back onto some black because we don't want to waste it. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm just going to then take, and again, check your folder. Mm hmm Yeah. We get an emboss and a deboss yeah. in embossing folders. And a lot of people think it's all about the emboss. We can get just a beautiful look from the deboss. I agree. But on this, what I want is I want the pattern to push up. Mm -hmm. So if you want the pattern to be raised on the front of this, put the white cuss a bit down to the outy bit. Yeah. So it pushes through. Right. That's it. Simple as. Fit it in my folder. There we go. Get it in. And I'm just going to again emboss that mm -hmm. through whichever sandwich works in your machine. And I would honestly say, it doesn't Ooh. matter whether you got your spray we could do it. you hundreds of lists of it's these with that. Uh -huh. It's this. It's this embossing folder with this. Mm -hmm. um, it's this plate. No, try it at home and see what works for you. Okay. Yeah. Because everyone's machine's different. They are. I, I don't care who it is. You know, if you've all, you can have five machines the same. They're all different. Yes. That's why I'm trying out this one. I'm hammering it for six months, and once I've done this prototype for six months and I'm happy with it, then we'll start to. Ooh. Look at it. If it goes so are we having a sneak peek of a, a yeah, possibility? Well, there is a Nelly Snellen one which is the same, which is yeah. available on the website if anyone wants it now. Right. But what we're doing is this is the original prototype because I designed the case for this. Cool. About Short 18 colours. months ago. And can you tell with it being blue and white yeah. and stripes? It is my colours. Yeah. Um, and before we actually order it and do the Crafts 2 one mm -hmm. or the press cut one, I wanted to make sure that I couldn't break it in six months. Because You'll, you'll, you'll try your best. Yes, yeah. I'm good at breaking things. <laughs> but yeah, the, it has been fully tested. The Nelly one works perfectly. That's so can you see cool. that? Very nice. That's so You've cool. You've got a real different fantasy jungle. I couldn't get that look anywhere else without. Mm. If you notice, this is me. Yeah. You're look, clean. What's, what's My hands are clean. What's going on? And I made that. And my hands are clean. Because it sprays yeah. and because they're... Good sprays, I nearly swore them. Yeah. <laughs> which is not, you did, you like, I did. Because that's normally what I say when I'm workshopping. People go, why do you love these? You know, why do you love Ising? And I say, because it's good. Yeah. And it is. So what I've got this time is, this is um, just a memento ink yeah. pad. It doesn't matter which black ink I use. Mm. I'm using this because I find this to be drier. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So I want it. And all I'm going to do is very lightly... Go over the top. 
Everybody's all right. <laughs> Okay. Now, because this is quite an open folder, it is quite difficult to do. Yeah. Because, obviously, it's hitting and touching in the middle. Mind you, it'll give it a bit of a distressed look. But I quite like that look. What I'm doing is just going round. Making it pop. And make the design pop. Mm. And this is what I like. Although these are sprays, although these are pigments, I couldn't do this mm. normally with some of the other ones. Because what would actually happen is that the, the ink underneath would resist. Right. So I actually quite like that. Mm. So just dress it up. So let's make it look intentional. Something, if, if something, something looks bad as if it shouldn't be, then make it look worse. But I think I've got a real jungle feel, but that's taken no time. Yeah, it's so yeah. good. I should really now wipe that down, but I'm not going to. <laughs> That'll do. He's back. Well, then that'll do, it's Matt and Lair or something else. <laughs> yeah. Don't sweat it. So what I've got is, now, there we go. So all I'm going to do, a little bit of glue on this. Mm -hmm. Matt and layer it up a bit. Matt and layer it up a little bit. Yeah. And then we will cut our flamingo. We need a name for the flamingo. We do, if anyone's got any suggestions, because yeah. he hasn't been named. No. Because this is the launch of them. These haven't been seen before. They're yeah. not anywhere else as yet. So we do need a name for the um Yeah, let's do flamingo, flamingo first and then we'll see about the other characters. Yes. That would be good. Um, so uh, email in to studio at hachanda.com or on Facebook, what name would you like for our flamingo? Okay, so normally I would phone Mountain. Mm. But, so I can go ah, in that way. Yeah, I like that effect. And you can see then I cover. Yeah. The gutted bit. The gutted bit. Mm -hmm. I, I never gut unless I've got a real use out of it. And if I've made my own paper, yeah. then I genuinely, to me, have got a real reason for it. Yeah. So, what we're going to do now, let's do... This is dry. Yep. So this is the piece we did earlier. Right, OK. Yeah? So I'm just going to take flossy. Oh, is that what you call him? I, I don't know why, it just came in my head, sorry. Flossy, flossy the flamingo. Someone's obviously just emailed that in, probably. <laughs> yeah? And we'll go with... I'll go, take that from there. Okay. We'll take that from there. And with the flamingo, you see, you get... Actually, let's go that way. Okay. You get a wing. Um, okay. So, I'm not going to do the pineapple for now. Where are we? There we go, mm -hmm. behind me. Honestly, I feel like I've brought half my craft room. I with know. Me. I've got so much back it's here. It's taken up the whole set. But, Have um, you got to get names? F uh, Phil? Can't Phil use, no, Phil would kill me if <laughs> yeah, I called him Phil, true. sorry. Yeah. Paul says Jackie. Jackie the Flamingo? Mm. I quite like that, actually. Yeah. Claire says flo oh, Flora or Flo. Quite like those. Hey, who was it that said Jackie? Yes, I know who that is. Oh, do you? I've got to say hello to Noisy. Nick. Yeah, I've, uh, uh, Paul and Elaine cop, uh, follow me and are quite good fr friends on Facebook. Right. And they've got a friend who I always call Noisy because she comes to the shows and she's very noisy. Okay. And she's called Jackie, I believe. So I think oh. that might be you, Paul, and I think you might be suggesting Jackie because I know she loves them. <laughs> so, but what I'm going to do is now these. I like the cut of the leaf. If you look at the leaf. Oh, look at that. That's but a lovely shape. How real shape. does that look with yeah. mixing that? But there's no that, green in there. No. That that's, was yellow and blue. Of course it was, yeah. So that was these two shades that made that. Mad. Very that's good. why you'll find there's not a true green. OK. Because you don't need one. Mm. What you need are the colours that will mix. Right. Then you've got the flamingo. Ah. Uh, there we go. Let's nice. show him that oh, way. OK, that's yeah. Better. I love his legs. But how real and his wing. Love that. I so, love the two-tone. I'm just going to give a little bit of glue to put the okay. wing on, and then... What else have we had? Yeah. Phoebe from Sarah. Hello, Sarah. Yeah, Cathy says, Basil. Fair enough. Basil. I quite like that one. <laughs> Basil the flamingo. So, <laughs> nice. But there we go. So you get his wings to add the, that on. Really good. So I'm just going to give him a waft with okay. my heat gun. Yeah. Because he's still a little bit. Only a little bit, don't you? Yeah. And I don't want him to do the next bit because this is 
I always think, I don't know if I'm right or not, Yeah. but I always like them to have a black beak, a black eye, mm -hmm. and black feet. Fair enough. That's all right. Yeah. yeah. So, I'm going to use my pen. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to use the fine point. Oh, the sticky ink. And I'm going to draw his eye. Yeah. I'm going to use the chisel. Because you can. And I'm going to colour in, because it's easier and quicker, his beak. Yeah. And then we'll give him colour in his feet. Oh, this is great. I love that pen. So clever. Yeah. And then just grab my black fine detail embossing powder. Mm -hmm. There we go. Do you want me to put that back? Yeah. If you don't mind. There we go. Got enough? Yep. Okay. Thank you Thank kindly. You. And then I'll just, I've not put, I've not let him dry well enough, unfortunately. So, doesn't matter because what I can do, see how the eyes work? Yeah. Black and shiny. Always try and make sure they're dry before you go on with the embossing ink. So, there we go. So, can I just have the... Black back. Yeah, black yeah. back. Because this is the great thing. You can go back in. I can go back in. Nice. I've got a pen. I'm just magic. You know, it's I, I just it's what I love. Yeah. It's just to me absolutely magic. And thirty so. percent of the this. Uh, oh, sorry, the set with the embossing pads has gone. Dunk his head in. I love it. Oh there yeah, that's go. a bit easier way. That isn't was it? easier. Yeah, you yeah. don't think of that until the end, <laughs> yeah. though, do you? <laughs> You've done it wrong once. Oh uh, yeah, so as we said, 30% of the stock has gone. 1199 uh, 109-936 is your item number. So there we've got... Clean it off. Hey, our little flamingo. I love the colours. Just works, but it yeah. doesn't that look as if you've spent hours... It does. ...colouring it yeah. and trying to do it skillfully. And of course we haven't. We've just... Cheated. We cheated. Basically. Yeah. Yeah, we've 